And here is the Hard Inch HC hand chucker. Well, it, it's actually adverse conditions, and uh, you know, I'm really, really going through a lot to make this video. I hope you all appreciate this because it's raining. <laughs> it's, just, it's just a few drops here, but uh, I'll tell you. I, yesterday was hot and uh, I, I got oil on the machine and everything's working now see whoop and I, I got the turret working and uh, let's see it go over here and look at the cross slide that's free so that's real nice now I got a I'm gonna get up here real good, get so you can see. I got a uh, 10 thousandths dial indicator on there. I, I can't see if you can see it in the, in the screen here, see the needle, but we'll give it a try. Oh, I pushed it forward. Hold on, let me try to get her back. We'll see what the run out here is. Come on. Oh, okay. Let's try it right about there somewhere. Let it settle in a little bit. It, it's about 10 thousandths. And the um, spec is, is half a tenth. And it's going to jump a little bit. Hit bumps and dust. And you got to figure that half a tenth of a thousandth is the thickness of a speck of dust. So I, I'm, I'm calling it around a tenth, and I, I think it's good. I, th I think the spindle's good. It feels like it's got um, grease in it, and I, I think it's okay. I think the machine's going to be good. Now, the, what I did, uh, if you've seen my uh, toss the uh, DRO, off the axle send and put a travadial on it. Well, I bought this thing and I stole the travadial off of it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that digital readout that uh, was on the axle send and put it on here. And I think it'll be a lot more useful to me. There's the turret. Eight position. It, it's just, I think this is going to be okay. And what am I going to do? I really don't have anything to make with it, but I'll set it up for drilling, turn, and phase, and bore, with a little boring bore on there. Then you can, you know, just do general things on it, like make bushings and pins and, you know, dust something out, dust out a bushing, or, you know, just kind of general stuff. I, I, I'm going to make room for it. So anyway, um, it, I'm going to have to throw a tarp on it. I, I don't know if you can see the rain uh, beating up on it. You know, I, I only want to de-rest it once. Here's the oil thing. Here I got that working, got it full, and uh, <clears throat> pumping oil through it. Oh, it's so nice to see this stuff work. It, uh, I, I determined it gets tight at, at, the, at the far end, pretty tight. And it's, and it's pretty snug up uh, um, at the spindle. So I, I figure there's about two thousandths wear on this bed. And that's not real bad for one of these things. This, this thing's still got some life. Okay, I, I got some Monarch things to be, I'm working on. So I'll get on those. Okay, 